today we are making a anchor chart um, or at least they call it an anchor chart when it's up on the wall and you're putting it in your notes so it's kind of part notes part anchor chart um, this one's for dis divisibility rules so if you would go ahead and write divisibility rules up at the top of your paper um, divisibility has a lot of I's D-I-V-I-S-I-B-I-L-I T-Y. Divisibility rules. Um, I'm opting to use some colored pencils here. Remember that you can use crayons or colored pencils, but um, no markers. Okay. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is make two lines straight down kind of in the middle. Okay. And then I'm going to make two lines across. It's, it's kind of like tic-tac-toe, I guess. Um, and into each of these, I'm going to put a different number and the rule for it. So I'm going to put a, a two right here. Um, and because I think it's fun to um, add some color, I'm going to be coloring mine in. Okay, so to um, to find out if a number is divisible by two, um, the rule there is um, it, a number is divisible by two if the last digit is even, okay? Um, or is it zero, two, four, six, or eight? Okay, it's divisible by two if the last digit is even, okay? Um, and now I'm going to do a by three, okay? Divide by three, okay? Um, and I think it's fun to make uh, the different numbers look different, so that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, a number is divisible by three if um, the sum of the digits is divisible. Um, I think I misspelled divisible. Okay, it's a D L E there at the end. Divisible by three. So, like, let's think about uh, multiples of three that you know, like uh, twenty-one. Well. The sum of the digits in 21, 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 is divisible by 3. Uh, 27. Uh, 7 plus 2 is 9. 9 is divisible by 3. Um, 33. 3 plus 3 is 6. 6 is divisible by 3. Okay. Um, and then let's do divided by 4. Um, I've decided to do this like a rainbow color scheme, um, but I know the yellow is a little harder to see, so I'm going to outline it with my pencil. Um, and you, you can use whatever colors you like and do it however you like. It's just my little tip for when I want to use yellow. Okay. Um, a number is divisible by four if the uh, last, last, Uh, two digits are divisible by four. Okay, so um, let's see, like um, 140. Okay, um, 40 is divisible by four, so 140 is divisible by four. Okay, um, 216. 16 is divisible by four, so 216 is divisible by four. Okay, down here, let's see, divisible by five. Okay. Divisible by five, this one you probably know. Um, a number is divisible by five if the last digit is a zero or a five. 
okay, 35, 75, 40, 80, um, 145, 350. Um, as long as the last digit is a zero or five, then the number is divisible by five. Okay. Divisible by six. Let's get a darker blue going here. Let's see. Okay. Spiral, that looks fine. Okay. Um, a number is divisible by six if the number is divisible by two and by three. Okay, so um, the number 12. 12 is an even number, so it's divisible by two. Uh, 12, the sum of the digits is one plus two is three, so it's divisible by three, so 12 is divisible by six. Okay, um, I'm gonna leave seven blank for right now um, because um, it's a little more complicated and I'm just not ready to do that just yet. Um, but there is a rule for seven. We're just um, not tackling that rule uh, today. So I'm gonna come over here and we're gonna do divisible um, by eight. Okay. And um, a number is divisible by eight if the last three digits are divisible by eight. Um, so that's not, that's not really going to help you with, um, you know, two digit numbers, um, or even really with three digit numbers, but if you were getting into some really large numbers, you just have to check the last three digits, okay? Uh, divisible by nine. number is divisible by 9 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 9. Okay. Um, so think about the, um, the multiples of 9 that you know. Uh, 18, 1 plus 8 is 9. 9 is divisible by 9. Um, 36, 3 plus 6 is 9, um, let's see, 108, 1 plus 0 plus 8 is 9. Um, once you get into some larger numbers, um, you, you may find that they add up to something more than 9, but if you keep um, adding the digits together, uh, the sum of the digits uh, will always uh, wind up coming down to 9, okay? And divisible by 10. Again, I'm going to my yellow, so I'm going to outline it with my pencil. Divisible by 10. This is another one you probably know. Um, a number is divisible by 10 if the number ends in a zero. Okay, 10, 20, 30, 140, 350. 1,270. As long as it ends in a zero, it is divisible by 10. Okay, um, so those are our divisibility rules. Okay, um, if you need to pause and go back to catch up, you can, um, but just make sure you have this page in your math journal.